this video we will see how we can uh, solve the error in laravel project that uh, basically leads by uh, the absence of the vendor folder okay so i will just uh, regenerate the error for you and show you how the error look like and uh, also show, show show you the solution of this okay so what happened is that when we download a project from the github and uh, somewhere else or download it from uh, from uh, code canyon okay so sometime what uh, happened is that we don't have any vendor folder there okay so that uh, that's the reason of uh, showing its uh, error like uh, no such file found and uh, composer file not required not found and something like this let me show you the error first let me just show you the uh, error first by regenerating them okay so what will i do i will just open the laravel project here and delete the vendor folder from here okay as you can see this project is right now working fine and it is basically served by the php artisan serve command okay so when i go to the laravel uh, project it's running properly but if the vendor folder is missing this is the vendor folder if i delete this okay after deleting this particular uh, folder you can see if i reload the window you will see the error unknown fail to open string this is no such file and directory directory in unknown on line number zero so basically this is the error you will see on in the absence of the vendor folder okay so let me just write it down okay so you will see this type of error so to how to resolve this what we need to do we just uh, go to the need to go to the uh, cmd okay over powershell and set the location to the set the location to the root of the project okay here what we need to do we just need to enter a command that this is composer space update so basically you will need to add composer and update and after hitting the command composer update you will see uh, right now there is no vendor folder but after the running of the command uh, as you can see it's uh, right now running the vendor folder appears automatically and all the dependencies of the project is now installing okay and uh, this is basically uh, fetching from the fetching from the internet and uh, let's just wait to complete this process so as you can see the command is successfully uh, completed and uh, now the vendor folder is visible once again okay so at this point of time uh, if we go again to the browser and reload the window okay first of all we need to uh, serve the project again start the server okay after starting the server if we reload the laravel project as you can see it's now successfully running again so basically this is the this is the root cause of the error that uh, is uh, leads to show us the this following issue okay so if you are having any question just let me know in the comment section i will be happy to help you okay thank you